Hello, Miguel from Grumo here, and I'm going to show you my latest no-code app. In this case, an Airbnb clone made with a Glide without coding whatsoever. Now, this app is fully customizable, and you can get it at grumo.com slash rent app. Now, the way it works is that you can create new listings, you can add photos, and you can add all the details about their specific listing. And then people can add reviews, a description. There's a host, in this case, me, with 4.77 average star reviews and nine reviews and all the locations. And then people would simply uh, find the location that they want and then they check availability. And there is a calendar. They can go back and forth in the calendar and back to today. And then they could select a date range. And once they select the date range, in this case, three nights, they can click on reserve three nights look at the specific details, they can enter a coupon uh, if it's available, and then they can book that location. They'll be taken to a checkout page uh, inside payhere.com, and then they can make the purchase and confirm the booking. Now, if you are the administrator, you'll be able to see a dashboard where you can manage all the users. You can manage all the coupons that are available and to see how many coupons are available for each coupon. You can either edit the quantity or delete the coupon if you don't want it to make it available anymore. And you can also see the overall stats in terms of how many users are in the app, how many locations you have, how many bookings have been made, and the total amount of sales, and also the most recent bookings and who uh, made them and whether the booking has been paid or not in case you enter the booking manually. Let's say that you are doing this just for private use and you have a friend that wants to rent one of your properties, well, you can uh, reserve the location for the specific dates that your friend is coming in and then once your friend pays for it, you could say, mark a spade, okay? So uh, this is not so much a marketplace as a tool to manage your private properties, but it looks and functions very similar to Airbnb. Now, if you're interested in building apps like this, you would find out that most of the interface is quite easy to do, but if we go to the Glide editor, the most difficult part is the actual calendar. So when I go to the calendar, you can see this is a very nice uh, calendar, and we can see what dates have been booked already, and if we try to book or select a date that has been booked, you can see that we get an error saying that that date is not available. Now, this was tricky to do because we have to look at all the bookings and then we create an array with all the booked dates. Then we add all the booked dates for a specific location under the locations. So if we go here to uh, array, the day, day list array is basically all the days that have been booked. We put that into a single array and they're under the calendar we pull all the dates that have been booked for that specific location, and then we see if the current date, that specific day, is it's inside the array of the booked uh, dates array. And if it is, uh, then you can see here, like these last three dates are part of the array, then it would show as booked, and therefore, uh, when we go to set the background color of that specific cell, we change the color here with the this conditional column that is looking at a bunch of different variables to determine the background color of the specific date inside the calendar. So for example, for the names of the weeks that are on the header of this table, we're using a background color that is pink. For any date that is available, we are using a gray color. If When we select a date or a date range that's black, and if it's a, a booked date, in other words, we cannot book it, the background is set to light gray, right? So a nice visual way to figure out what we can book and what we cannot book. So in this case, we're gonna book from the 20th to the 24th. We can always change the dates. You can see the selected dates are marked as black. We can select a different uh, date range. And again, we can just reserve those nights and pay with pay here. All right, so if you want to make a copy of this app, just go to grumo.com slash rent app, and you'll be able to play with this app, customize it, add and remove features as you wish. And now if you want to learn how to create apps without coding, just check out my new course at grumo.com slash 
go glide and you'll learn everything you need to know in order to create very amazing apps using glide thanks for watching bye bye